This morning, the minute for mission will be presented by Paula DeLuca. Paula is the moderator of the Board of Deacons, and Paula, thank you so much for your willingness to do this today. Hi, everybody. Nice to see you all. Um, did anybody know today's Abraham Lincoln's birthday? And it's also two days from Valentine's Day, so I see a few reds out there. That's cool. Um, I'm representing the deacons and just wanted to let you know a little bit about us. Um, it consists of nine people. We're a little bit short right now, so when I introduce you to our deacons, we'll be one short. But there's, there are eight of us. There are eight ladies. And what our purpose is, is to help you feel connected to the Laley Presbyterian family. Um, each of the deacons has a group of parishioners who are either members, friends, or affiliates of our church. And recently, we all received a new roster of people that are going to become our flock. That's what we call our group of people. Um, and because they are our flock, you are our flock, we are your shepherds. And what we are here to do is to provide assistance to you just as you need or as you want. Um, what we're going to do is be contacting you either by phone or email or text or also possibly here in church. Um, not all of us feel comfortable doing, uh, connecting with you in the same ways. Um, so we, in some way, we will be able to get uh, to introduce ourselves to you. I want to let you know that we only want to do this to make you feel comfortable. Um, we don't want to be intrusive at all, but we just want you to know that, that we want to connect with you. We want to be here to care. Um, if you'll let us, we'd even love to send you a birthday card or an anniversary card. Um, but um, you may have some pastoral needs, uh, and there may be an illness or something going on in your family or with friends that you need a little more care about. And I would direct that, or we would direct that to Pastor Ed. Um, so any prayer concerns that you have, um, any kind of suggestions, if you just want to talk, that's, we're here for you. So that means that we might contact you um, once or twice a year, but if that is too intrusive, just, just let us know. There are some people that we call once a month or get in contact with. There are some people that we call once a week. And uh, I have to tell you that I've been a deacon for a couple of years, and I started when it was the pandemic. And so um, I started calling the people that were in my flock. And it's amazing in how short of a time you can get to know people and just grow to love them. Um, I just enjoy those phone calls so much. And unfortunately, most of the people that I had that I spoke with are over 90 years old, and I've lost a few the last few years, which is so sad, but I feel so blessed that I've had the opportunity to be able to talk with them. And um, another thing that we can do for you, um, I was so blessed this week to be able to provide communion with Betty Dakota, um, our new elder, um, at their home, at, a per at this couple's home. And that was just so nice to be able to do that for people. So I'd like to introduce you to the deacons that we have who are here this morning. And if we do not contact you, please feel free to call the church office and, and let them know that, that you would like to have contact with somebody personally. So here are our deacons. Um, there is a, a Sharon Berkey. She was at our first... Um, our first service. Jay De La Paz, if you could please stand up so people could see you. Jay De La Paz, Val Hoffman, Helen Johnson, 